a lot of people, if you drive, if you live in a part of the country uh, where you might see electric power plants, you'll see this shape with steam coming out, yeah? And they may be coal burning plants or nuclear power plants. But you're going to see this basic shape here, and you're going to see what comes out of this is actually steam. Not, not, that's just steam. Because inside is water. And it, it, when, you, when you create um, uh, power using, whether it's coal or nuclear power, you got to cool things down. And this is the tower they use to do that. It turns out the reason they use this is because it's the most efficient shape for cooling things down. And how do we get this? Well, if we kind of chop this part off and chop this part off, this here, all this is, if, if we were to keep going, this is a hyperbola, yeah? And if you just take this middle part here of the hyperbola and then create a three-dimensional object here, you get that shape. So this is an application of hyperbolas uh, in, in electrical power plants. So hyperbolas are also used uh, in ellipses. Their lenses are used in telescopes. So it, it comes down and you see the light. It goes through a bunch of elliptical shaped uh, glass pieces and hyperbolic shaped glass pieces. And, and different shapes and they go through and after a while it magnifies it and you get to see a better picture of, of planets and so forth. So that's another application of hyperbolas and ellipses. But these things are used uh, you know, in everyday, everyday part of our lives.